The concept of electronic leviathan was developed on the basis of research into a product of electronic government, ICP Brazil or, the Brazilian Public Key Infrastructure Infraestrutura de Chaves Publicas Brasileira, conducted by Marcelo Barra. Most of the data used came from interviews with those involved in ICP Brazil's development, including politicians from the executive branch, technical experts in the bureaucracy, members of the banking and business communities, representatives from lawyers' associations the OAB, the Brazilian Bar Association and academia, as well as representatives of the information technology industry. ICP Brazil files and regulations were also used, along with presidential speeches, and e-government legislation. See also Barra, 2009 in EDUSC. How can you prove that you are yourself in the Internet? How can the authenticity of a document sent via Internet be proved? ICP Brazil, the Brazilian Public Keys Infrastructure ICP was developed to answer these two questions, by providing a form of identification and authentication in the Internet. ICP Brazil was created by Brazilian state as a mechanism that allows for the so-called digital signature, with validity recognized by this state. Technically, ICP Brazil is a set of legal norms based on specific technoscientific knowledge. The electronic leviathan It is a theoretical and interpretative construct to understand ICP Brazil's process. First, the developers of ICP Brazil sought to guarantee the conditions needed to ensure the existence of the state itself, a concern which had eventually led to an increase in centralized power. Those developers' next priority was to diminish insecurity on the Internet by enhancing security when using software connected to the net by combating what was perceived as a possibility of monopoly formation or anarchy in the digital certification market, and by somehow controlling the use of the Internet as a doorway to the sort of anarchy that prevails in the world of international relations. This was a state that guaranteed security. At the same time, it tried to settle the dispute between financial institutions and the Certisign Company since the banking community was worried about the possibility of a market monopoly, the possible dispute among banks over the digital certification market, and the struggles among bureaucratic structures. This was a state that ensured peace. Several elements in the ICP Brazil case involve the state and tie into the electronic leviathan in various ways. These elements are a. The reason of state, including concerns regarding the state's security and guarantees to ensure its continuing existence. b. The control of society by the state. c. The political decision-making structure, starting with the head of state. d. A domination strategy emanating from the bureaucracy. e. The power of the police. F. The treatment of asymmetric cryptography, a dual-use technology controlled by states. G. The consideration given to international practices as evidenced by the comparative examination of other states' laws and users of that technology. H. The issue of national security, linked to foreign relations and the geopolitical configuration of states, leading to an in-depth analysis of what and how was being done in other countries. I, updating the way war is waged cyber war. J. Containment of problems relating to sovereignty and territory. <laughs>